one. Good morning. It's the Orlando Gardner coming at you. And we have a guest and a subscriber <laughs> here today. Why don't you introduce yourself? Hello, 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 everybody. <laughs> My name is Shauna. Mm -hmm. um, and I met this gentleman oh my goodness a few months ago um at a park yes selling vegan food yes she she prepares vegan meals yes i do yes and he's standing in my backyard today because um i did at one time have a beautiful garden uh -huh. that i had the pleasure of eating out of for two years yes and um in a different home now and i have this thick backyard and and wanting to start it again and I have just been so blessed <laughs> that God put me on his heart to come see about me and yes. Yes. here we are yes so this yes. is gonna be the start of an amazing project yes yes so behind you to my left your right you already have some some fruit here. I growing. do, I do. Uh huh. Now what? Now, so now, what is this? this? Is, uh, navel orange tree. <laughs> navel orange tree. Okay. Yes, yes. All right. My goodness, that's one of the best oranges in Florida. About to take it in the house and juice it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yes. And then to uh, my right, you have uh, sugar cane. Sugar cane growing here. Mm -hmm. Okay, and it mm -hmm. actually looks like U10, uh, which is a very big variety. A lot of people, that's actually in demand. But oh, wow. Yeah, that is, that is really nice. Don't even know what I have. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and there's okay. some pineapples that we attempted. Okay. Mm-hmm. So. Yeah, so we're going we gonna to put get this yard into shape. And uh, and then you got a mango tree here. That's right. Oh, she's... um. From what you're telling me, she's in good shape, but she looked a little tired to me. So <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, we can get her nice and big and strong and produce some juicy mm -hmm. mangoes. Yeah, and we will, we will. And for the viewers, this is a Glen mango, so she has one of the one of the the really good ones. And uh, we're gonna we're gonna turn this part of the property over into a backyard food forest, and she's gonna do all kind of peppers and. All kind of things like that. Now you have a, a, a vegan business, right? I do. I do. Yes. Why don't you tell us a little bit about that and what the name of it and when you started it and everything? Okay, it's called Soul Vegan Good. Mm -hmm. um, Where can we find that on YouTube, Instagram, Instagram, Instagram. and Facebook? Um, okay. So Soul Vegan Good. So it's with three O's and okay. Vegan Good, just like it sounds. Yes. Um. I actually attempted, and I'm going to say attempted because I'm not 100% vegan, but um, yes. I do adhere to almost a fully plant-based diet. Yes. Um, I attempted to go vegan, as I said, uh, two years ago, mm -hmm. um, and just realized the benefits of how I feel mm -hmm. um, eating a plant-based diet. Mm -hmm. And my goal was to help others mm -hmm. feel as good as how I felt. Right. Um, just just trying to um, eat better yes and so in doing so I've always cooked uh -huh. um, I decided to start selling some of my vegan treats yes so in order for me to be somewhat successful I veganized my favorite foods oh wow and um, mm -hmm. more, more more people than I thought loved it and here we are today yes so now I have a weekly meal prep service where I provide um, very healthy 100% um, plant-based meals uh -huh. for people to help them become as healthy as they can be okay. um, in their journey to um, veganism. Yes. And it's just helping people to see that eating a vegan um, lifestyle, it's not boring. Um, we're not mm -hmm. eating grass and tasteless, mm -hmm. um, <laughs> flavorless food, but um, a vegan lifestyle is, is amazing. It's mm -hmm. um, colorful it's yes. flavorful and it's all in how you prepare things it's right. like for people who are carnivores yeah you don't take meat out of the packaging and just throw it in a pot right right so um with veganism you do have to put a little effort and creativity and and making foods that not only taste good but are good for you so yeah. um starting the garden again will help me be able to um, come out and pick out some things out of my my own garden and eat mm -hmm. instead of spending so much money. Yes. Um, 
in the produce stores but okay here we are okay so uh is there they can find you on instagram and facebook uh, uh -huh. is there a number they they can reach you at or, or you, they just go through the site you um just... they can go to instagram and facebook uh -huh. um, for so vegan good mm -hmm. and a phone number where i can be reached is 321 321 591 591 2147 2147 yeah yes well that is awesome and uh, we're gonna we're gonna film this journey of getting her backyard. So excited! Yeah, excited, huh? Very excited. Yes. <laughs> yeah, turning this into a backyard food forest, and uh, we look forward to uh, working with her. Look forward to bringing that to to uh, fruiting capabilities. Yes. And, yes, um, yes, yes. Uh, so this is the Orlando Gardener coming at you. Just wanted to share this with you, and um, also uh, before she goes. Uh, uh, she's getting ready to start a YouTube channel coming up soon. So we'll 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 be talking about that y'all. So uh, this is Orlando Gardner coming at you. Y'all have a good one.